Hey everybody, it's Scottish Jillian. Welcome to my infrared sauna vlog. This is where I sit in my infrared sauna, I sit, sweat, detox, meditate, get focused to get clear, connect to my guides and spirit and angels and man, there's a lot coming in these days. So this is also where I talk about spiritual topics and since I've been quarantined now for 26 days, <laughs> I've had a lot of time to meditate and a lot of time to do a lot of readings and when I do readings, you know, I have to tap into the sort of collective and what's the most likely outcome in the moment, you know, and it's been intense, I'll admit it. And so, um, and I've said this before, I'll say it really quickly. It's really, really, really important to keep our vibration high. And because of the energy that we are being inundated with on both sides of the coin. And that's really what I want to talk about in general. So I'll just make what I was going to say just now part of this whole thing. There are two massive energies that are hitting the planet. 5G energy, which is you know, the, the next generation cell, but it's more than cell now because it's going to be an entire grid of every device on this network and tracking and, you know, a whole matrix, right? So that energy has just started to be rolled out in 2020. And as I said before, we had a massive pandemic sort of, um, in conjunction with that coincidence, maybe, I don't believe in coincidences, so whatever. So, with that type of energy hitting your body, you may feel, even if you don't get like fully sick, the f effects of that may be headache, um, tiredness, uh, joint pain, abdominal issues, nausea, that things like that, and shortness of breath sometimes and you know it can come out into a full-blown illness too so to combat that feeling and that um, energy that's taking its toll in your energetic field and your physical body you have to and this is what I was gonna say before you have to really take care of yourself and so things to do to offset that and also all this fear energy that we were surrounded by and, and that is being propagated by whatever. <laughs> um, the machine. <laughs> it's really important to do these things. Okay, take salt baths because that clears your energetic field. It replenishes you with negative ions and it gives you a, just a whole energetic reset, right? Plus it's totally relaxing, stress relieving. Detox like this if you can't do this then you know any type of sweat or um, Even a hot bath will actually detox you too. Drink tons of water Tons helps with the detox. It also is helpful if you bless the water change the vibration of it immediately clean eating primarily um, Plant-based, you know, which is great. They have plenty of produce in the stores, which is unbelievable Bless your food, <laughs> you know Keep your body moving, obviously. Stretch, do things like that because that is one of the things that is a negative aspect of staying home. Um, I got sweat in my eye, my God. And <laughs> just being in a positive frame of mind. Okay, these things are all super duper important and being positive and being in gratitude is one of the biggest lessons here because, you know, obviously this is very challenging. <laughs> And so doing all these things to raise your vibration physically will totally counteract not only this 5D energy, but it'll also boost your immune system and pr protect you from not just this nightmare out here, but other things that can, you know, attack your immune system. So that's one big aspect of the energy that we're being inundated with on this planet right now. On the other side of that coin, <laughs> On the positive side of that coin, we are also being inundated with 5D energy, 5D light waves from another part of our galaxy, right? Probably the edge of our galaxy and even the universe, or I don't even know, but 
these light waves and particles are so foreign to our human energy field and our human body that we are going to have to also integrate this. I do believe this 5D energy energy will help counteract this 5G energy that we're being inundated with. I believe that because of the way the vibrations are. But 5D energy, fifth dimensional energy, also has effects that can be unsettling if you're not, you don't know what to expect. So one of the things is you can start to feel lightheaded or sort of out of your body or like as if you're floating, you know, or sometimes when you wake up, you can feel like you're not grounded or you're not actually in physical form. Wake up from sleep, that is. You can also start to have lucid dreaming. You can also sometimes feel slight shortness of breath because it's so... It can, feeling dizzy and feeling all these feelings that you've never felt before can sometimes elicit adrenaline because you're like, oh, why do I feel this way? Am I, am I having a panic attack or is something crazy happening? But it's just your body acclimating to this high dimensional, five dimensional energy that is going to take you out of the pure physical and put you partially into the non-physical, okay? And as we approach the full 5D integration of humans, we're going to have half of it non-physical and half in the physical, <clears throat> which I said before is like God's playground. That's the best place to be, being able to experience the physicality of the third dimension and the non-physical world that we have been not privy to for so long as human beings, you see. See, we're being let out of our prison, finally. So it's really important not to get bogged down into all the craziness because this is happening. And this is where we're headed. And all of the craziness will settle and wash away because this high fiber, vibrational five-dimensional light is like... Phew, completely going to transform humankind <laughs> forever. <laughs> it's like, this is the biggest deal ever. <laughs> and all of us have chosen to be here during this time. So it's something to be rejoicing about. And I know that it's challenging in a real human sense and a real financial and a real physical health sense. But if you keep your vibration really high and positive and know that all is well, and this is what we signed on for when we came here then you can get through it easier and you can have peace knowing that God, you know, or your higher power or spirit or whatever you call it is there and has got our backs. And as I've mentioned before, we have massive amounts of interdimensional help, massive, partly because the dark had really gotten out of control on our planet and we really needed a little backup, right? So... That's a huge deal too. And soon, I believe as we progress into the fifth dimension, we're gonna to start to be able to see our neighbors and our interdimensional friends because whew, as we ascend and transcend, they will be visible to us. So how exciting. <laughs> All right, so thank you so much. We're gonna get through this, I promise you. I'm trying to get everybody that I know is a light worker on the page because it's time to come and stand at attention and be there for humanity by helping to raise the vibration overall, okay? So please subscribe, we'll get through this. I promise it's gonna be amazing on the other side and oh, 